Good morning, Crafton Elementary families and students. It is Friday. You made it through another week. Congratulations and great job on all of your hard work, your completed assignments, your watched videos. Great job. And thank you again to the parents who are doing such a good job helping the students at home, staying in contact with the teachers. I can't say thank you enough. And thank you also to the parents who sent in pictures of all of the students from last week's Teacher Appreciation Week. It was amazing to see our students in their sunglasses or in their superhero costumes. So thank you so much. And I appreciate that Spirit Week and the support you showed the, the staff and teachers at Crafton Elementary. Well, it is Friday and it is time to tell a couple jokes. Jackson. Jackson wants to help us with the joke again. So we do. We have a joke today. And this joke is from Jasmine. What is brown has a head and a tail but no legs? A penny. That's a good one. I have a joke from Ethan. Ethan says, what has legs but can't walk? You know? No. No, a pair of pants. <laughs> That's a good one. And then Jackson, I think he made up a joke. He wanted to share a joke that he made up all by himself. What was your joke, Jackson? What do you call a two can when there's only one? A one can. A one can. <laughs> That's a good one that you made up. All right. Well, I was so happy last week to share some amazing shout outs to my kids. Uh, in grades third grade through sixth grade that or fourth grade through sixth grade that we decided to do it today for K to three. So listen, listen, we have some wonderful shout outs to share. So Miss Alex says her whole class deserves a shout out. They are going above and beyond. And they are sending pictures and videos of everything that they are learning. Way to go, Miss Alex's class. I have Miss Zirko's class. She would like to give a shout out to her entire class for a wonderful job with their commitment to education and this transition into remote learning. Everyone has done a nice job completing the assignments, turning them in, and sending them, sending her pictures and videos. Good job. And Miss Helfrich also agrees that she wants to give a shout out to her entire class for just going above and beyond as well and doing their work and turning it on time. So go kindergarten. Miss Price, I she just couldn't choose. She said her whole class is putting forth an amazing effort in all hours of the day. And even if they miss a day, they're making up the work, sending pictures and videos, and she just can't share how proud she is of them. Miss Rochelle agrees with Miss Price. Shout out to all of her students, her whole entire class, for doing amazing things with their activities, with their lessons. And Miss Rin says, ditto. Shout out to her entire class, to every single one of those students for going above and beyond, working so hard, and making sure that they are able to turn their assignments in on time. Mr. Bassano says Giada consistently completes her daily work on time and sends pictures of her work. Penelope is so conscientious and completes her daily assignments. Evan, he's, Evan's an early riser who gets to work completing the daily assignments and submits them on time. Mr. Dara, shout out to Darren. He's always completing work on time and sending pictures of his work. Miss Bigler, shout out to Olivia. She shows up every day accepting extra challenges and sharing 
thoughtful third grade writing responses during the novel study. From Mr. Kuhn, shout out to Jameson, always first to log on, and he always leaves a positive comment to other students in the stream. He is engaged in the virtual learning process. Ms. Vitali, shout out to Andrew. He is the first child to turn everything in each day and work so hard. And when she calls him, he is reading and reaching those goals. Mrs. DeRoss, she wants a shout out to all the kindergarten for being total rock stars with their work. Ethan in first grade for going above and beyond. Jordan in second grade for working hard and getting his assignments done. And Jeffrey in third for his strong effort for completing the daily assignments. Miss Costco. She said, in kindergarten, shout out to Faith for doing such an amazing job. Shout out to, let's see, first grade Jaden, second grade Evan, third grade Jeffrey, um, and Logan. I might have skipped a couple. Let me see. I think I got them. And shout out to, from Miss Jovanovich. Um, she just thinks her classes, her students are doing amazing. However, Faith Harper and Arabella seem to really jump on board and complete all of those assignments. Miss Serena, shout out to all who share their work with her. Seeing the artwork truly brightens her day. Keep that coming. Mr. Ficarelli just is so excited for people who are responding to him every week. You are clearly on the ball. Mr. Priori, shout out to John in, let's see, John Clear, Ida Varhi, Sophia O'Brien, Dakota Darnley, and John Engel. They've gone above and beyond all their music work. And Miss Sumter, shout out to Ethan in first grade, Juniper in kindergarten. They could both complete their work on time and have very nice comments to clean up her day. So though that was a long list, I'm always proud to share the positive things happening at Crafton Elementary. So please keep doing that work, keep showing your three Bs, showing up on time, and you can get a shout out on the Friday announcements. And the last thing I wanna share is, I didn't ask for any pictures this week because you were sending them into the PTA, but this week I wanna see some pictures. I wanna see pictures of you, and or your family playing your favorite board game. I know there's been some cold days and hopefully we'll get warm again, but until then, we're playing, we're playing board games, we're doing puzzles. So my son Jack did once to share his favorite board game with you to get you in the mood. All right, Jackson, what is your favorite board game that you like to play with either your brother or your whole family? Horse, pie in the face. Why is that your favorite game? Because you like to get sticky with pie in your face? Yes. Do you find it funny when someone else gets pie in their face? No. Oh, no. Not even mommy. No. So send that picture in of you with your favorite board game or you and your family with your favorite board game. And to close up your Friday announcements, Stay tuned because there is a special video at the end of this that I want you to watch. All right. Other than that, have a great Friday, a great weekend, and a great week. Come say bye, Jackson. Bye, everybody. Bye. Back, 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 back